what would you say your experience was like in the club? Man, first of all, uh, I loved it, man. I look forward to the live streams every Saturday. Yeah. Uh, most times I was traveling to to play at um, at church, so mm-hmm. I just been listening to everybody, um, everybody's work, man. The the camaraderie, the the um the encouragement. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, I I love that, man. You know, and you know, like I said, the thing that really brought me on board, everything that really captured me was, um. Just like even the, the 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 stuff that you guys put out on YouTube, man. You and um you and um sticks, you know, and he's an excellent he's an excellent coach, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, he really pushed me. What do you feel changed about your playing? I have more of a flow in my playing now. Mm-hmm. Uh, which is one of the things I really struggle with. Mm-hmm. Um, tra- transitions, mm-hmm. smooth, just being smooth in transitions. Um, these phases, man, I'm not gonna lie. Um, the 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 linear fills, um, the sheds, you know, they have real like, like I said, I've never, I didn't come up with all the guys like the Glenn Gibsons, the Isaiah Tom, you know, Isaiah like shedding and being in church. I wasn't, I I, I ain't had drums in my church, you know. what I'm saying I I was just by the time drums came in my life, I was like in my twenties. So I didn't have all that. And then I didn't have even people around me that was even doing that. So, you know, the whole shedding and all that stuff, man, and trading back and forth and trying to come up with ideas, you know, like I said, it's 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 truly a push, man. How has your practice changed from how you practice before to now? Oh man, I go a lot, man. You know, that 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 whole concept of taking taking an idea. And work and and having a start tempo and working it like for five minutes and working it up. That's so highly effective. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Um, you know, I actually I I look forward to practicing. If you were talking to someone who was thinking about doing this, doing something like this, or just doing the shed camp club in general, and they were on the fence, like. Ah, should I do it? Would it be worth it? I don't know if I should do it. What What would you say to them? Man, I, I would tell them, honestly, to go forth because for me, especially playing in church, let's say, or even doing stuff outside the church, um, everything is, is, is applicable, you know, and it's important to have someone that's going to hold you accountable, you know, like the whole recording myself and submitting videos, that was a new thing for me. And um, you know, just just it helped me to really connect more of my instrument. Yeah. You know, tell them honestly, you know, listen, it, it's you can't go wrong when you're betting on yourself. 